welcome back friends so today we are going to learn about btd btd is nothing but bearing temperature detector so normally in a rotating machines uh, we have btd and rtds so rtds are used for winding uh, temperature detection with resistive temperature detector they are called and for bearings those are called as bearing temperature detectors so in this topic we are going to cover up bearing temperature detectors so on screen you can see this is the motor and this is the bearing cup inside this cup uh, bearing is housed and to know the temperature of the bearing there is a probe which is connected and it is called as btd bearing temperature detector so this btd is connected with the help of wire and as you can see on screen these are the wires which goes to the metering seat, metering uh, panel uh, and or your tripping circuit so the temperature which is detected on the probe is taken to the btd box and this box all the wires are connected and from this box all wires are connected to your metering circuit so normally uh, there are many kind of btds uh, three wire six wire so in every uh, rotating machine have two bearings and accordingly have two btds one at drive end side and the other at non drive end side so now uh, let's see the non drive end side btd so as per the wiring we can we just stretched out the wire and the btd is mounted on the non drive end side below the cooling fan so you can see this is the fan and behind that is the bearing and bearing housing so this is the bearing housing so your btd is mounted on the bearing housing with the help of probes so when the bearing is placed on the housing all the temperature generated by the bearing is transferred to the housing and from housing it is transferred to the btd so this on your screen you can see a bearing housing or some people say uh, it is end shield now let's see how bearing is fitted on it so this is just for your example this is your housing and this is your bearing so when the bearing rotates it will generate some temperature this temperature or heat will be then transferred to the end shield and from end shield it will transfer to your btd so let's remove the btd and see how it is placed so this is a bolt type uh, btd means the probe is ha is is designed like a bolt here you can see this is the probe so this probe goes inside the bearing housing and it is connected over there so whatever temperature is generated by bearing will be transferred to the end shield or the bearing housing and from there it will be sensed by the btd and transferred to your metering circuit so this is how the probe is assembled please know that uh, this is not the only way of fixing btds there are many other methods by which btds are fixed on the bearing housing or the end shields every manufacturer has different methods of fixing bearing housings and there are many types of probes also so some are of 6 uh, leads some are of 3 leads so depending on the designer and the application the probe design may change 
so friends uh, now we are going to see what is bearing temperature detector so this is a normal ball bearing as you can see this is a normal ball bearing and here are the all the details of the bearings okay and this this other balls so this this other balls so you can see there are many balls so these are the balls and this is inner race this is outer race so this is inner race and this is outer race so basically here your shaft will fit here your shaft will fit and on the outer side your end cover will fit end cover of any motor or generator will fit over here and the rotor will fit over here so basically what happens when the bearing is placed on the shaft and the cover this part rotates this part rotates here you can see this is the rotation so when when this part rotates uh, the balls also rotate with the inner race so then uh, due to the rotation and the friction effect some temperature is generated over this race and inside race also so <coughs> so basically let's consider that uh, we we must have some so let's consider that we must know what is the temperature of the bearing so either we have to put a prep probe on the surface of this on the surface of the outer race surface of the outer race over here or surface of the inner race so the most identical or the most easiest method of testing uh, or knowing the temperature of any bearing is putting your probe over here so putting your probe of your BTD bearing temperature detector above the upper race will let us know what is the bearing temperature so now let's see how a BTD looks so this this is a model of bearing temperature detector so this is our probe so this is our probe you see so this is our probe and this probe is designed in a shape of a bolt so basically this is uh, done because uh, the end shield above which this probe will fit will be having a threading and then this will fix like a bolt and this will keep the probe intact so let's move on so these are the wires of the BTD okay so these wires will be connected to your metering circuit uh, where you will have a uh, meter or an indicator a alarm switch or a trip switch so these three wires will be connected to your metering circuit and this is a probe which will be connected or installed above your bearing so let's see so suppose this is your bearing and this is your probe so the fi uh, fitment will be such way that the probe your BTD will be in contact with the upper race of the bearing so here you can see this will be fitted this way so there will be some arrangement made uh, on the end shield to fix this probe on the upper race of the bearing most of the probes are fixed on the upper race in some cases the probes are fixed the sideways so it will be fixed or either on the upper race or the lower race but it will be 
touching the bearing some at some point so that we can know what is the temperature of the bearing so you can fix it this way also on the outer rest you can fix it this way also in the inner rest or you can fix it on the top rest also this way so depending on the model of your rotating machine your PTD is fixed so this is a working principle and the fixing pattern of your BTD. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.